Meals on Wheels in Raleigh County delivers almost 150 meals a day to many homebound seniors. Without it, they'd have to find another way to get their food. And that scary thought may become a reality under the government's new proposed budget plan. The cuts target the Community Development Block Grant, which helps fund programs like this one, where the majority of our elderly community counts on. Uh, they're alone, and in many respects, and many of the individuals, they have no one else to depend on except us to deliver a meal to them, and quite frankly, to be in touch with them, to make sure that they're okay for the day. Although the proposed elimination of the program has not yet been confirmed, the threat to Meals on Wheels has become a great concern in West Virginia, especially to the elderly recipients. I can't stand up and cook because my breathing and my lungs won't let me. And I either, well, I started getting those and they were a godsend. I would have starved to death had it not been for them. Meals on Wheels is their lifeline, and often the only companionship or nutritious meal they have in a given day. Only time will tell if the funding necessary to keep Meals on Wheels alive will continue. But in the meantime, the program is accepting donations to help our elderly community. In Beckley, I'm Rebecca Fernandez reporting for Newswatch.